Good afternoon guys and welcome back to another vlog. I got up this morning, I did some editing, I finished my birthday vlog which I'm so excited to preview um, and I just cleaned the house, cleaned my room, cleaned the bathroom because your girl is going on holiday on Monday. I'm so 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 excited for this trip guys you have no idea I am going to Miami <laughs> the Miami has literally been a city like on my bucket list for like the longest time ever I was like if there's one thing I really want to do it's jet ski in Miami just because I don't know like I watched CSI Miami so much when I was a kid in New Zealand and I just remember seeing the skyline and the water and it being like the big America like yeah, and now I'm going. I'm so excited. So welcome to the vlog guys. This is a prep for Miami holiday vlog. I got my nails done yesterday, which I love. Barbie, sort of like chrome pink. Yes, I'm going to get my hair done this afternoon. Yeah, and I'm going to pack this afternoon. I'm so excited guys. So sit back, relax and enjoy this vlog. my haircut guys in the Oxford Circus Gusto hair salon and I didn't get it styled because it was gonna be like 110 pounds so I was like no not today because I'm just going home tonight and doing some packing um, but yeah I actually came across like a really nice part of London and took quite a few like photos to remember like for cute cafes but yeah just gonna head home now home guys and it's been such a rainy day in London um, but I've got dinner I treated myself to some steak broccoli and rice this is like my favorite dinner and I'll show you guys what I got I got like these cute slides for like I don't know the airport some jandals these are only a pound and like this bum bag to like go here or like here because I like have my phone, my earpods and my passport and I just don't want anything to get stolen when I'm on the trains and the tube and stuff and yeah like my cousin got her passport stolen the other week and she's had to be at the embassy and everything it's been like a big dilemma so yeah 
got one of these so I'm gonna eat my dinner and start packing outfit so this is one I ordered these bikini clean going for love 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 so I've just finished like my base packing so all my clothes and everything um, so I'm gonna pack my bag now but I'll probably repack it tomorrow I want to kind of buy one of those like luggage things you like put on the handle and it weighs your luggage like I don't know why I've never bought one of these the amount of times I travel but yeah I'm gonna pack my bag head to bed and I will see you guys in the morning Good morning guys, it's 10.30 and I'm just going to head to the gym. We need a good booty pump for Miami, so let's go. So I just finished my gym session, which was so good, smashed glutes, and now I'm just walking to Argos to buy one of those weight um, luggage things, because I feel like I'll use it so much, and some American adapters, because I don't have any, so off to Argos I go. Excited. Literally, Miami has just been on the bucket list for I don't know how long, but like just even saying I'm going to Miami, I'm like... I, I don't want the holiday to come because I just want to keep saying, I'm going to Miami, going to Miami. But yeah, let's pack. All my packing's pretty much done. Um, just bought travel insurance, double checked my Esther, and yeah, I'm so excited guys. I'm playing like house music while I pack, and I'm just like, I can't believe I'm going to Miami tomorrow. I'm like, this is why I moved to London. Like, I would have never ever been able to afford to go to Miami from Australia, so. Winning! So, I'm just packing my fanny pack, because we don't want to get pickpocketed on the train. But I've got my spending money for Miami. So I've had this money for like three and a half years um, because when I lived in Vancouver and I used to work there, uh, the Americans used to come to Vancouver from Florida because it was so hot at the time. And they always used to like pay in American money and like tip us fat, like 25%. And you were like meant to like cash it into the restaurant and like change it to Canadian. But American money was so strong, you always like kept the American money. And I always knew like I would want to travel more of America. So I've kept it in my passport folder for like three years, waiting till I return back to America to spend it. So I've got my spending money for Miami. It's all my hard working tips when I lived in Canada. So that's going in there. And then also I'm going to check my Esther for like the fifth time because when I lived in Canada and I went to Vegas, if you guys are our OG vlog watches, vlog 10, I went to Vegas and I literally got like held in a room and like 
interrogated and I flew into America with the wrong visa and it was the most frightening experience ever. So I always get very anxious going into America. Um, so I'm gonna triple check I have my Esther and it's all good. So pretty much I was living in Whistler and I was on a Canadian visa, visa and when I was traveling to America, my passport was gonna expire in six months and you can actually get denied at the border if your passport's gonna expire so that soon, especially in America. So I was like, okay, I'll reorder a passport. So I had a passport sent from New Zealand, the exact same like person, everything sent to me in Whistler, but I didn't think that the Esther wouldn't be on the new passport. I thought they just like electronically swapped over, but it didn't. And so then I flew into Nevada, I think it is. And yeah, I didn't have the right documentation and it was, it was frightening. So check that. So hopefully, it's all good and that's gonna go in there but um yeah I just spoke to Mel and I'm so excited I can't believe this is gonna be like a trip we will remember forever girls trip Miami when I'm 25 let's go hello ah! hi. say hi to the vlog I'm, I'm literally walking around um, Old Port Montreal Miami, Miami, United States, United States, United States. So, hey guys, I have just come to Starbucks and got a coffee. I'm boarding my flight in half an hour and I'm so excited. Hopefully, no more hiccups, had a smooth check in process, bags, everything. So, yeah, next stop, Miami. I'm so excited, guys, you have no idea. This is this next vlog is gonna be unreal. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in my next one. Bye. through immigration which was like two hours the flight was delayed an hour 10 hour flight but we're here fam we're here